Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nock. Welcome along to a brand new video. Today we're going to play Siberian Breaks from Ampy. If you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. Really appreciate the support. But without further ado, let's jump into the description. Wide open arms can feel so cold. So cold. Medium difficulty bounce gel puzzle. Favorited by p 2 k and Asiaz16. Eight second timer, I think. All right. Can I see anything in there for now? I'm going to get back in there, though. How do we get back up there? Hmm. Interesting. Let's go over here. Now I'm guessing this is going to reverse the funnel. Alright. Don't know why I'm saving. Saving makes no difference. At all. I'm dealing with live bridges. Uh, okay. So clearly question number one should be Shazam. So, I done did mess it up a little bit here. So let's get plenty of gel in here. Literally, this is like the third recording in this slot I've done today, done right now, and I've been distracted and interrupted on every single recording. So I apologise for the this in the last two days. Like seriously, I have not had a clear day at all um, of recording, which is frustrating. Um, okay, so I can go through here, and I can stand on there. However. It's not going to bode too well for doing anything else on a more permanent base, is it? I can't actually do that anyway. So, what we're going to need to do is do something like that, but press the button. The next question is, how are we going to do that? The time has come to push the button. Because I need to, like... Alright, so here's what I think i got to do. Well, I say that, but then... How would I get over there? So, okay. Let's go back a minute. So, i, I got to use the light bridge to get over to there first. Okay. So, we do this. And then what? I jump across... Like that. Uh, 
And if it ain't phone calls, it's the wife. <sighs> nobody, nobody, nobody understands the concept of knocking. All right, so I need gel on his bridge. So this is what I need to do. I need to get gel here. The question is, how do I do that, though? Okay, so I can do this. Pull myself across here. Pull the gel to there. Then pull myself. Pull this across here. Do that. So that should now give me a way over to here. That's how we get back up to here. Which is all right, but then... Okay. This is the only thing I can think. And that's why we save. Because I shut the wrong pole. Actually, there is another way, isn't there? There is another way. Alright, so... I go across to here. Then I do... This. Jump down. Do that, do till it all goes through. And then I can do that, but I don't think that was enough. But I think that's the idea. Yeah, if I can get more gel, then I can get it onto there, and then, yeah, okay. That's what I need to do. I just need more gel than what I used there. Um, so, across here with the funnel, pull gel through here, Okay. How does that sit now? Okay. Should be able to do this now. Excellent. Save. Next up, I assume we're going to want this cube. Why do I want that cube, I wonder? I don't want that panel. Come to think of it. Let's 
See, if I hadn't reloaded and saved, this would all be covered. So I could then jump up to there. And that grating is basically to stop what I wanted to do, which would be swap to the, swap, put a portal on there. I just, I don't see what I need this for. All right, let's take a slight back step, just for a moment, and I'm just going to set up what I would have had here. Okay, so we'd have had that, and then we'll go back to this, and this. So we had this, right? I don't get what I need this for. Recall the cube. Obviously, I can spread the gel along here like this if needed. That makes that completely bouncy on the bridge. I don't get what I need to do here, though. Why do I need this to be bouncy? If I take the cube back here, I lose the bridge there. And then I'm just back at exactly the same spot I was before. So how do I... How do I... But yeah, clearly that grating is to stop me from pulling the cube back too far, just literally pulling it in there and running around. Don't get it. I 
I don't get what it is you want me to do, Ampy. No even way to like block the cube of the light bridge. So I was thinking about instead of using the funnel at the end, what about using the light bridge? But still not gonna be able to um I'm still not gonna be able to get like in the right position. With just the light bridge. Get out here now. You know, all sorts of weird things are going through my head at the minute, like, what if I painted the cube? And I'm pretty sure this isn't right. But yeah, what if I painted the cube? something like this. I'm just gonna... Clearly not the right thing to do. By any way, shape or form. don't understand what that is doing for me unless I was to do something like what we did before but with the light bridge instead Do we just repeat the step again? Yeah, but then that pushed it that way this time, doesn't it? So yeah, we can't do that while that's on there. That brings us to here. push this way so yeah 
that's not gonna work. So the other thing as well is it doesn't really matter how long, how much distance I have before this funnel because that's all that matters. I'm only ever going to be able to get off here once that's at there. And just to sort of demonstrate a point. Uh, okay. Maybe not. Keeps going everywhere. So I can pull this back here, look. I had a portal over there. And there's literally like three blocks, so. It'd be like. That's it. That's as far as I'd get before it reset. Which is my point. It's. It's crazy. Why is this a thing? I just generally don't see where I can like benefit from because I said about maybe using like the light bridge as a holder but even if that was like on there with the light bridge, I'd have to do it here. And I'm not going to be able to move all the way down here in the time it takes to travel three blocks there. Well, um, I'm going to have to give this one some thought, I'm afraid, people. I'm out of time. I'm not going to get back to work. So, yeah. And I have to see if I can think of anything else that I'm, I'm overlooking. The, the problem is I don't even see the ending manoeuvre, which doesn't help. Not being able to see the ending manoeuvre means I don't know what I need to do. Or how to set anything up. Likewise, I don't really see what that's the, the intent of that is at the minute. Put there. I come through to this side. But I got no way of getting gel on there because of where the cube is now. So that really wouldn't work. Alright, I'll give us a thought. I'll back momentarily. Alright, guys, we're back. And after a bit of thought. Um, I kind of played myself, so let's let's just go back a little bit. Listen to what I say. If I take the cube back here, I lose the bridge there, and then I'm just back at exactly the same spot I was before. But I'm not. I am not. So, what I came to realise is let's get rid of that. What I came to realise is, this is actually an all portal puzzle, isn't it? That's what the point of that is. So, what we're meant to do, as you'll see in a minute, we fizzle the cube. 
which gives us the null portal which then allows me I should, I, if I had gel here I've, I've reloaded the game which is why I've lost all my gel uh, put that in there then that gives me all the time in the world to get back over here and do this Yeah, it took me a little bit of time to sort of think about things, rewatch that playthrough for just like sometimes I find like watching back what I've already recorded helps. Um, and at that point, when I kind of fizzled the cube, I think I'd sort of forgotten that sort of like in the subsequent ten minutes or so after that point in, the, in my previous in like the recording earlier on, um, I'd sort of forgotten about respawning the cube. And so I went back and I did that. And then I realized, actually, I can now put this cube in there. So, um, but yeah, wasn't that a pretty good puzzle? Um, pretty good puzzle indeed. The uh, null portal part was certainly the bit that stumped me the most. Um, I think I did pretty well on the rest of it, getting the gel everywhere and the light bridge in the right places. So, uh, yeah, good job, Ampy. Thank you very much for making the map and the suggestion. Guys, as always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any match you'd like to play, please leave in the comments or head to my Google form. I'll link to that in the description. But until next time, I've been Nock. You've been awesome. See ya.